am here with a legendary game creator, KJ Inafune san We are talking about Mighty Number no. 9. This game looks fantastical, and I want to play it. What is it about this genre specifically that is so fun to create a game world around? The player and the, uh, the main character that he's controlling, the connection is really strong, it's really direct. So people can you know, easily understand the control, start getting moving and having that you know, good feeling from the gameplay. So I think that's the main reason. It's easy to get into this kind of genre and it's challenging, it takes time to get better. That's why I think uh, people like this kind of genre. And who exactly is the Mighty Number no. 9? Is that a specific character or what happened to the other eight? So Mighty Number no. 9, the main character Beck, is the, uh, the youngest sibling of this whole Mighty Numbers. Actually, the Mighty Numbers is a team that compete in what we call the, uh, the Battle Coliseum in the robot combat tournament. And they are actually the strongest team. However, Beck is actually the weakest link. When this whole robot virus uh, break out, Beck is the only one who didn't get affected. So it's now up to him to save his brothers and sisters fighting against them. So being that Beck is the weakest of the night, how does he get stronger? Does he go to the gym? Is he just running power-ups, bulking up? Beck himself, he actually doesn't have any you know, sort of special weapon or ability to himself. But his fellow mind numbers, his brothers and sisters, they actually have one ability that's, you know, that's unique to them. But Beck doesn't. His ability is to copy and manipulate other robots' ability. So as he goes along uh, defeating you know, his brothers and sisters, he will actually gain their ability, copy and scan them, and incorporate to his own use. So the further he goes, he will gain more ability, more power, and get stronger.